Hey, this is Katie Reed for the Northwest Avalanche Center. I'm out at Hurricane Ridge today um, in the Olympic Mountains, and I'm looking to kind of check out the new snow that's fallen in the last week. We had between 8 and 12 inches uh, on Wednesday, um, and then a little bit of snow after that. I'm just poking around to take a look at the structure of the new snow that's coming this week uh, on the east aspect below tree line. Um, and what we're looking at here is uh, about an inch of new uh, soft snow on the surface. Um, it is getting warmer and wetter as the day goes on, uh, but about an inch on the top, sitting on top of about an inch thick melt freeze crust, which is sitting on top of another about seven inches of very, very consolidated, compacted new snow, uh, making for an excellent slab. Uh, that's likely the snow that first fell on Wednesday. So as I've been out here skiing around today, uh, for the first half of the day, I wasn't really breaking through this harder crust that can be found just a couple of centimeters down um, below this kind of light density snow on the surface. Uh, but as the day's gone on, that crust has gotten quite a bit softer, um, and I am able to actually kind of break it as I'm making my turns. So keeping an eye out on that, definitely an indication the, the snow surface is getting a bit warmer. Uh, that coupled with the light density surface snow is becoming much easier to make a snowball out of and I'm actually starting to soak my gloves a little bit when I do so. A couple things to think about going into the weekend up here at Hurricane Ridge. Uh, we're going to want to keep an eye on this new storm snow. Uh, we're going to want to keep an eye uh, on how well that continues to bond with itself and the snow it's sitting on, uh, as well as just watching for that to get warmer if we do have any increasing temperatures. Uh, in addition, we've got pretty steady winds um, up along our ridge tops right now, so keep an eye on our wind slabs. Uh, these can be found right now um, on our northwest, north, northeast, east, and southeast aspects.